Can you give us any hint of anything? Any, I don't want to, you know, get you in trouble with the studio or Marvel, but I mean, maybe could you even just... A Do little title? Something? Do we know the title? Could you... Uh... All right, I think I could probably tell you that. <laughs> really? I, I think it's out there already. The, 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 the title of the next Avengers movie is... That's out there, right? I, I can't believe that you just told us that's the biggest spoiler no, that's, ever. That's out I, there. I don't want to get no, you in I, trouble. I swear, that's I'm out not, there. No, all right. It's okay. Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, that's, I, I thought it was a spoiler. I mean, we, we all reacted to it. That's, I mean, can you, can you give us a, 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 an, another spoiler? An actual spoiler? <laughs> I mean, now no, that that's already no, out there, no, I mean, come on. No. Dude, you won't get in trouble. No. I mean, that's already out there. Come on, they love uh, you. They, okay, they're just... They're... <laughs> There's, this, there's one thing I'm really excited about, and I, I don't think this will be giving away too no, much. No, just don't, don't give away too much, yeah. So, in the final battle, Bruce Banner is in... All right? Yeah. And, and he wakes up, and he's like, oh! Turns into the Hulk, he busts out of this tank, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's like... Boom! He jumps in the air, he's flying, flying, flying! This is Hey everybody, it's Charlie. So Mark Ruffalo tried to spoil a whole bunch of stuff about Avengers 4. He said that the title is out there, so I do think that he was actually mouthing something and they bleeped it and they just NDA'd everybody in the crowd. Just to be clear though, that's not me bleeping that video. That's directly taken from Jimmy Fallon's broadcast. So whatever they were doing, the people did that while Mark Ruffalo was speaking. There's a new Spider-Man PS4 game giveaway. All you have to do to enter is be a subscriber and leave a comment on the video. You may have heard the rumor about Avengers Annihilation lately. That's like the latest supposed inside rumor. Mark Ruffalo saying it's out there. And here's the other thing too. They bleeped him the whole time he was trying to give away spoilers, but they put a black bar in front of his mouth when he was speaking about the title. Then when he did his second subsequent spoiler filled rant, they didn't cover his mouth at all. They just bleeped him. Again, just more evidence that the title, like he said, was out there. He wasn't lying when he said it's out there. So it's not really a spoiler because people already know it. But since it's not Marvel officially revealing it on all of their social media accounts, you just have to take it with a grain of salt. And if you haven't read the Annihilation storyline, that's all about Annihilus in the Annihilation wave trying to destroy all life in the universe and Thanos sort of playing both sides against each other and him getting killed himself. So it's not like Thanos versus the Avengers. It's a much, much bigger story and involves a whole bunch of X-Men based characters like Galactus that Marvel doesn't have access to quite yet. Like they just finished wrapping most people on it. They still haven't finished the deal with Fox. So if Annihilation really is the title, then they're probably just borrowing the themes of that story in that because of something that Thanos does, say erasing half of all life, it leaves the universe vulnerable to another attack that's going to wipe out all life. During the comic book storyline, Annihilus enters our universe, the 616 Marvel Universe, through this bleed between universes they call the crunch in the negative zone. Drax winds up killing Thanos, there's a whole bunch of double crosses, Galactus reveals that because of what's happening with the Annihilation Wave and Thanos' actions, a couple of ancient gods that he imprisoned at the dawn of the universe have been freed and are now threatening everyone. So it's just absolute chaos, and what they might do because they said that Avengers 4 is supposed to have a totally different plot from Infinity War, it's not even part 2. That even though Thanos will return, it's not just going to be the Avengers reversing everything that he did. It implies the plot is going to be much more complex than that. So you could wind up with a scenario where the Avengers do have to get Thanos' help with something. The only storyline I could see that would involve Thanos working with the Avengers on some level, if there's some greater threat that threatens all life, not just half of all life, would be something from like Marvel's The End storyline, which is non-canonical, but it involves this really crazy twist with Thanos absorbing the universe and then killing himself, sacrificing himself so that everyone can live and they reboot everything. But that comic book storyline isn't canon to the main comics, so there just could be a situation where we wind up getting rid of Thanos through some slightly different means. Like right now it's all about Nebula getting revenge on Thanos for everything that he did to her as well as what he did to Gamora. 
But there really isn't a whole lot of footage from behind the scenes that corroborates anything that happens during the Annihilation storyline. Like, we're still thinking about this on a pretty simple level, with them trying to get everybody that was turned to ash back. You probably heard the rumors about Ronan Hawkeye in the Skrulls. Skrulls were involved during the Annihilation storyline, but mostly the Super Skrull, the Kree, the Nova Corps. It was a very space-based storyline, so obviously they were used quite a bit. Fun fact, Annihilation Conquest was a spinoff of that storyline. That served as the origin for the new Guardians of the Galaxy team that served as the basis for the movie team that we've been watching in the MCU this whole time. So I'm still trying to take this with a grain of salt. I wouldn't call this absolutely confirmed, but it definitely suggests that that's probably the title because I still think that he was speaking truthfully when he said that the title is out there, meaning that people have figured it out and have been talking about it. It would still fit with what the Russos were teasing the other day because of those two ladders and the two A's that they formed, like AA. It's supposed to be a single subtitle, so it's not going to be multiple words. And they've already confirmed that it's not Avengers Endgame, Avengers Forever, Avengers Eternity, Legacy, Avengers Assemble, or Avengers Disassembled. So if it's still two titles and it's two A's, there are just only a couple of possibilities for what it could be. Let me know in the comments, though. Do you think that he was actually mouthing the real title and Marvel is just going to reveal it at a later date? Studio or Marvel, but I mean, maybe could you even just... A Do we little know the title? Something? Do we know the title? Could you? Uh... All right, I think I could probably tell you that. <laughs> really? I, I think it's out there already. The, 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 the title of the next Avengers movie is... Because Kevin Feige did say that we would learn the title after we got Captain Marvel, then they would officially start promoting Avengers 4 like they would for a normal film by the end of the year. So I'm not really expecting any big footage or anything like that till like November or December. But there is a certain cycle for these things. So like the title is something that we'll probably be learning really, really soon from Marvel's official channels. Not just the Mark Ruffalo, Tom Holland, Spoiler Bros channel. There'll be more Venom stuff happening tomorrow. I'll name the giveaway winner when I post that. There's a couple videos that I'm behind on. Click here for that new Avengers 4 Captain America teaser and click here for my non-spoilery Venom review. Thank you so much for watching. Everybody stay awesome. I'll see you guys tonight.